day, lords and ladies of the internet. I am your host, the Power of Fox Archangel, the English gentleman of the internet, and I welcome you back to Imori, where we are currently in Basil's house. I think we're going to start by talking to Basil. Oh, oh. hi, Sonny. Yes, hi, Basil. What's wrong? It's it's nice to finally see you again. Ha ha ha. Why are you staring at me like that? Uh, um, Sonny, is is everything okay? Um, Sonny, is is everything okay? Uh, is that the last thing you gotta say? Yep, yep, that's exactly what it is. Well, we can look through the photo album again. There are an awful lot of pictures missing, which is kind of interesting. A bunch of books. Most of them are garden about gardening or indoor plant care. Well, given the amount of flowers, it makes sense. Tonight, for tonight for dinner, we're making vegetable chicken vegetable soup. How's that sound? Soup and veggies? Sounds nutritious and delicious. You, you really think so? I was afraid you'd be a bit disappointed. People always ta tell me that my taste is a bit bland. Don't worry about what other people think. All food is good to me. I'll eat anything you throw at me. Dinner will be ready soon. Please feel free to make yourself at home. Well. Let's take a look at in inside of how everyone's... do. Oh, that's probably the grandma, isn't it? Ooh, what's that? A white ergant orchard. In the language of flowers, it symbolizes the phrase, My thoughts will follow you into your dreams. Huh. Okay. Hi, Basil. Oh, Sonny. I didn't expect to see you in here. <laughs> What's wrong, Basil? H how are you doing, Sonny? Is everything okay with you? Okay. Never mind, then. Grandma can't hear us, you know. She hasn't been feeling very well lately. It's been four years, hasn't it? I'm assuming that's since what Mari died. It's nice to see that you're still around. Even if it's only for a little while. Here. Take my photo album. I want you to have it. I'm trusting you with it, okay? I just think you can probably use it more than me. Are you sure? Basil gave you his photo album. A lot has happened since th these pictures were taken. Sometimes it feels as if it was all a bad dream. It's hard to remember now, but I think at the time I took photos of what I was most afraid to lose. S flipping through this album, you can still see the good times. Maybe one day, things can go back to the way they were before. Sunny! Basil! Dinner's ready! Okay, coming! Ah, oh, Basil. I wonder if it's going to stop me from going into the other rooms, or... Oh, no, it's not. Hmm. What's this? Basil's camera. It looks really dusty. Ah. Well, let's have some dinner then. Polly and Kel's homemade dinner. Would you like to eat some? Yes, I would. Kel's just happily eat devouring away. Everything tastes so good. You're the best, Polly. Oh, it's nothing. I'm just following Grandma's recipes. Thanks for your help, Kel. Munch, 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 munch. So like I was saying before Polly, tomorrow, munch, 
My older brother Hero's finally coming back from college. My mum's all crazy right now, preparing the house and everything. Munch. Don't want to be anywhere near that mess. Although... Munch. I'm pretty excited to see him, Munch. Every every time he comes back, the, f the first thing we do is compare heights, Munch. This is the, this year is the year, Munch, that I'm Munch gonna finally I'm finally gonna be taller than him. I can Munch, feel it in my bones. Hehe, <laughs> you and your brother seem close. That's good. Family is important. Oh hey hey Munch, what what you doing with Basil's photo album there, Sonny? Oh uh oh, I I gave it to him. I just thought he should have it. W whoa really? Munch. That's so cool of you. Makes sense, Munch. Especially since Sonny's moving away and all. W what Sonny's... M moving Oh yeah! I thought I already mentioned it, Munch. I must have forgot, Munch. He's moving in, Munch. Three days, I think, Munch. Sorry, I thought you already knew. Uh, oh. Uh, no, I guess I must have missed it. S sorry. Um, m may I be excused? I, I have to go to the bathroom. There is definite awkwardness between Basil and Sonny. Despite Basil apparently having been his best friend. What happened? What's up with him, Munch? Well... That's just how it is. When you gotta go, you gotta go. Huh. Huh. So for those of you interested, I'm in the recovery stages of a cold, so if today's episode is a little shorter than normal, that's why. Basil, are you okay? Everything is going to be okay. 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 Whoa, what the hell is going on here? Uh, oh, it, it's you. Sonny, you're here. I'm so glad. Uh, you... You can see it too, can't you? Something behind you. What is wrong with you, Basil? Are you okay? Sonny, wh why why do you look so scared? Uh, Sonny, everything is okay now, isn't it? Probably not. Sonny, why why do you look so scared? Oh, hi there, pal. I've seen you a couple of times. Why are you being a prick and following me around? Alright. I don't know what's going on now. Or what I should say. Can you just leave me alone? I've seen you all over the place. I've seen you here. I've seen you in the dream world. Go to hell. I think I'm just meant to leave. W wait. P please, Sonny. Don't leave me. Not again. Maybe I wasn't meant to leave? I love how I just shake my head like, nope, I'm not going in there. So what's happening here now? Oh, hey, Sonny! I think it's about time we went home. It's way past my curfew. So yeah, anyway, Polly, if you ever need me, here's my address. I'll, I live just down the block. Thanks, Kel, you're sweet. <laughs> oh, it's nothing. Say goodbye to Basil for me. Uh, you're probably wondering who I am, right? I'm nobody, really. Just a nurse who is taking care of Basil's grandma, mother. A few months ago, Basil's parents hired me as Basil's caretaker since they travel out of the country frequently. I do. Tr I try to do as much as I can for Basil while I'm here, but... Ever since I started staying here, I can't shake the feeling that Basil is trying to avoid me. 
I wonder if I'm doing something wrong. No, I'm pretty sure it's got nothing to do with you something doing something wrong. Basil! Oh, Basil! Aw, oh, poor guy. He's always had a weak stomach. Hope he feels better soon. Right. Well, I guess I'm going home then. Is something gonna happen? I'm a little unnerved now, is all I can say. That's my house, so let's take Kel back to his. Wait, hold up, Sonny. I know it's been a while since you've been over to my place, but you might not ha have a good time here, here. Oh, so you don't want me to walk you home, despite the fact we're neighbors. Okay, fine. Then I guess I'll just go to my own house. Hey, Sonny. Thanks for hanging out with me today. Sorry for all the trouble. That was a pretty neat adventure, huh? I can tell you haven't talked to anyone in a while, but that's okay. It just takes practice. Anyway, Hero's coming back from college tomorrow, so I'm sure he'll want to see you again, see you before you leave. So, if you don't mind, I'll be coming back for you again in the morning. Good night, Sonny. Sweet dreams. Yeah. Sweet dreams. What did that sound? What was that sound then? Um. What's going on? Oh, okay. Ha! Whispers emanate from inside the box. Something tells me. Hey! Something tells me Sonny's not having a very good, healthy home life right now. Yeah. Especially with all these spiders around. Let's pick up the knife again and make sure it's... We have it again. Just because we probably need the knife against whatever the hell is coming out. Oh no, I need it to cut through the cobwebs. Right. Okay. There we go. Is this what happens when I don't do my chores? I mean, I guess that somewhat makes sense, but still. I wasn't expecting it to get this bad in a singular day. Huh. What is that? Oh, it's nothing. It's just a figment of my crazy imagination. No kidding. Right. What's going on now? This does not look good. Cobwebs, spiders, lots of creepy crawlies. Now there's things appearing across the screen. Hey! Stop attacking me! I think Sonny is quite scared right now. Alright, Sonny. It's okay, you can get there. Sonny, just a little bit more to go. Uh, it would certainly help if things stop trying to stab me! Oh, it's you. What are you? Come on, Sonny, confront it. What? Are you? Hello? What? Was that Mari? Was that the ghost of Mari? If I think I remember from the picture- Hey, I missed that! What the hell was that? does not look like a very fun thing. I think I need to calm down a moment. Come on, Sonny, calm down. 
Suddenly calms down, recovers 40 hearts. Something entangles Sunny, sticking his speeds fell. Is this spider s spider thing? Something is trying to talk to you. Sunny's attack did nothing. Maybe we just need to keep calming down if it's trying to attack me. Or trying to talk to me, I should say. Oh no, it's trying to eat me. This is getting nowhere fast, huh, Sunny? What the bloody Christing hell are you? My attack did nothing. Huh. I love how I keep my eyes closed in this fight. This is... It seems like there's a lot going on. You need to block out the little things and figure out what's... Um, figure out what's important. You clear your mind and remember how to focus. Focus. Sunny Snake's attack deals more damage. Okay, Sunny focuses. And like that, I win. I love how I just squished the spider and it's gone. Goodbye, spider. Don't be an- don't be a prick. So... I guess I should go to bed now. Would you like to go to sleep? I think I would. That looks like there's something there. Like it's a ghost. Is the ghost of my si dead sister there? Or something. That's what it looks like. Huh, Sonny was with Basil, then he's all by himself. Then he's stuck in his own little head. Is that- is white space the re the- the visualization of how much Sonny has just, you know, cut himself off from the world? Huh. Interesting. And there is definitely a part of him that is a psychopath. Noted. Good to know, I suppose. Welcome to White Space. You have returned once more, as you, are, you have been living here for as long as you can remember, and you want out. Right. So... I'm now in Mori again, aren't I? Yes. Why can I stab myself right now? Meow, waiting for something to happen. A light bulb hangs from the ceiling, wherever it is. Would you look at the light bulb? It's pitch black inside, you can't see a thing. The music is very soothing, actually. What's inside the sketchbook? Anything changed? Nope, still got that black, th uh, annoying black thing. Alright. Still need to find the rest of these, don't I? For whatever that phrase at the bottom might be. I have no- I've never been good at Hangman. I could not tell you for the life of me what it is. Why can I stab myself? Screw it, I'm intrigued. What happens? If I stab myself now, the music stops. Interesting. And Sunny wakes up. The cardboard boxes are littered across the house. Uh, why was there a person right there? There is nothing here. There is nothing here. I'm not convinced about that. So, I can go to white space to stab myself just to wake up, is what you're telling me. Interesting. Yeah, I figured you'd still be behind me, you little, uh, you little ass. 
You kind of have a thing for me, don't you? Did I just see something in the window? Yeah. Yeah, sometimes there's just things you don't want to deal with. That is among the list. Alright, well... I guess I should just go to sleep then. Are we going to see anything new? Considering... No. No, we're not. Okay. So now we're back in the real world. The red hands are here. Excuse you, what? The little hecky heck was that? You know what? Let's just go through the door. The white door casts a faint shadow. Would you like? What would you like to do? Open the door. We need to go explore a, explore this world, find more puzzle pieces, and see what the bloody Christing hell is going on with everything. Hey guys. Welcome back! See, Hero, I told you not to worry. Imori always shows up when we need him. Is everything okay, Imori? We were worried about you. Now that you're here, let's go out and look for Basil. He's counting on us! Be patient, Kel. We have to make sure Imo that Imori is, is okay first. Or maybe you, can you and Hero can go yourselves. Come on, Imori. Let's go exploring together. Just the two of us. You know, there's certainly some sort of crush that's going on here. I'm not sure which way it is, but there's some sort of crush going on here. Hey, you can't leave us out of this. He's right. Aubrey, we have to do this as a team. You, you never know when you'll need someone's help. We're stronger when we work together. Imori and I will be fine on our own. You'll protect me, won't you, Imori? Ew, gross. Get a room. Come on, Aubrey. It's time to get serious now. Let's go tell Mari that Imori is okay. You know how she's always worrying about him. Okay, okay, fine. I was just trying to have a little fun. What kind of fun? Never mind, I'm not going to question that given your age. A photo of someone familiar. I love how it's just someone familiar, when it's very likely to be... Sss, going out, Imori? Sss, here's your allowance for today. You've got 750 clams. That kind of says something about what we're going to be doing today, if that's our allowance of this day. Let's go check on Basil's plants. As well. Hi, Mari! Hi, Mari! Look, Imori is here! Imori! Stop disappearing like that! You know my heart can't take it! Hmm. So there's still no sign of Basil? Where could he be? We're not sure. We've been looking for him everywhere and still nothing. Uh, I hope Sh Basil is okay. I miss him so much. Yeah, I hear ta hearing him. I miss hearing him talk about all the stuff he's into. Like all the flower stuff, and the photo stuff, and the art stuff, and the reading stuff. My hair is so tangly. I miss when Basil used to brush my hair. Imori, will you brush it for me? Well, I miss when Basil used to remind me to wash my hands. Look, they're so dirty. Ha 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 ha! Ew, Kel! Kel, you should probably wash your hands anyway. Everyone, I know it's tough right now, but we have to stay positive. We should all try to be like Basil. Even when Basil is upset, he always manages to smile. That is not a healthy kid. So, is there anything, any way you haven't checked yet? Well, there is a forest west of the stump, but... It's gross and full of spiders! 
Ugh, spiders. Well, you know what that means. Once again, it's time to face your fears, little brother. And that means you too, hero. <laughs> Come on, big bro, you can't back out now. It's just like how it was with Imori. We're here to support you all the way. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> I'm just being silly. Don't worry, guys. If anyone or anything tries to hurt you, I'll smash it out of the way. You can count on it. And don't forget about me. I'll always be there to help, too. Yeah. Yeah. We can do this together. L let's go to the, the forest west of the stump. Lead the way, Amori. Well. Let's complete your quest, then. Is that a flower puzzle? For me? Maybe Neb will finally notice me now. Oh no, I said his name. Please pretend you didn't hear that. Thank you for the flower puzzle. Here's a gift in return. I picked a bunch of them earlier. Aren't they pretty? You got a daisy from Daisy. I wonder when I should give this to him. Aww. So, what's a daisy do? Plus 10 hearts, whereas starts happy in battle. Interesting. I can see that working quite well for Aubrey. Especially with Aubrey's skills for wanting to be happy. Alright, what's this? Sweetheart's quest for hearts. Riveting. Sweetheart. Sweetheart. Uh, six out of five stars. Sweetheart. What are you gonna say, boss? You guys still haven't found Basil yet? You guys are such losers. Let me know if you find him, okay? I just want to know he's safe. Ooh, I can have a picnic right now. You want to have a picnic? Yes. What does everyone say with I have a... Let's see. There's Daisy. Then there's Neb. Then there's Happy. Bows. Browse. Nose. Wait, no. That's Daisy. What you doing, Kel? Nothing. Just trying to remember everyone's names. Yeah, that's always a hard thing to do. You still don't know everyone's names? How could you? I'm sorry, okay? I just want to have a good time. We're all having fun here, aren't we? Everyone's names are secondary. It's alright, Aubrey. Hero never remembers anyone's names either. <laughs> it's probably a family trait. <laughs> hey, I've been working on that. For some it's natural, but for others it's a learned skill. We can't all have a memory like Imori's. <laughs> oh, I, I, lo I love puzzles. What do we have to look at, say, if we look in the mirror here? A floating mirror. Your f friends w smile warmly behind you. Do they? Is there any differences? I think the background might be bigger, di diff darker, but I'm not sure. It's hard to say. Hi, Beryl. What's going on? Grumble, 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 grumble. Hey, Dad, come here for me. Oh, uh, did you want something, Burley? Yeah, stand right there and look that way. Okie dokies. Aubrey, come here. Now, Burly. Aubrey! Aubrey, 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 Aubrey! What's with that sa- What's with that sassy tone? Come here, we're best friends! Now, you see that big guy over there? I know who Van is. Great! Go on and give him a good whacking for me. What? Why? What if he gets hurt? Always with the questions. Can't you just do something without thinking for once? Go on, smash! I mean... Alright... I'm sorry, what was that background in the photo then? Also, that was a lot of fun pictures right there. 
black. Okay, there, I did it. Now what? Do it again until I do it until I say stop. Okay, but what am I doing exactly? No questions, only smash. You're getting somewhere, I think. Come on, you can do it. Stamina, stamina. How long do I have to keep doing this? Until I say stop, don't slow down now. What is going on? <laughs> Help, my arms feel like noodles. Keep pushing, you're almost there. What is going on right now? I think I'm going to pass out. Please, just one more smash. Huh, huh. Hi -ya! Aubrey gained 50 juice. Huh, what was huh, that all about? Nah, uh, nothing really, I was just bored. But honestly, this is pretty boring too. What? Huh, that's all? Hey, at least you got something out of it. I'm still bored here, Grumble Grumble. Come on, Van. Let's play some tetherball. Huh, huh, I, uh, I just don't get Burly at all. Is Burly meant to be Kim? Actually, yeah. It's Vance and Kim. I've just realized that. This is why she interacts with Aubrey, because that's who her best friend is. Huh. That makes a surprising amount of sense now. Also, Jesus Christ. She now has the most amount of juice out of everyone. Why are you buffing Aubrey to become the most powerful character in this game? Well, I probably should now, just... What the heck? Hot diggity dog. It seems that I am the perfect length to block this path. But... But... I need to go water the plants. The hell, man? Oh, cutscene, okay. What's going on here? Oh boy, oh boy, I've been waiting so long for this event. It's a delightful day indeed. Ah, the marching of the sprouts. Oh yes, oh yes, at last our glorious princess sweetheart will finally make her appearance. Oh my, oh my, I can hardly contain my excitement. This is sure to be the most electrifying of them all. Oh dear, oh dear, we must hurry. Our four front row ticket show tickets are right here. We're in the we are sh we are in for a sh we are in for the time of our lives and must not be late. There's a reason I have a sore throat. Now, which way do we go again? Okay. Why do we immediately start fighting them? You know, this is probably going to be one of those few times rebound is actually a really good ability. Bounce that ball everywhere! Wow, you did an awful lot of damage to everything. Yeah, that did almost nothing. So obviously we have to bread slice. You know? Kel can guard, and then, uh, yeah. Kel guards, Imori stabs, gets bread. We gain 72 experience and 8 clams. And tofu, and tofu, and show tickets. Fun. Hey, cool, those sprout moles dropped some tickets. Let me see. Oh, they're front row tickets for some kind of show. Featuring Sweetheart? 
Wasn't that Captain Space Boyfriend's boy Captain Captain Space Boy's ex girlfriend? Yeah, it what? It, yeah, it looks like some sort of contest or something. If we happen to pass by, we should stop and watch. We do have front row tickets, show tickets after all. Well, all right. Maybe we can drop by if we happen to come across it. Now can I go past the dog? Yes. Now I can go past the dog. It's probably because of the... F Whoa, looky here. Those flowers are in an awful state. I've been neglecting these so much. Imori gained one heart. Huh. So his maximum heart has increased by one. Interesting. I, I, I would have said you probably should gain the heart based on whose flowers it is rather than Imori get rather than just Imori gaining it because he's watering the flowers. Hero gained one heart. Oh cool, perfect. So is it random who gets the, the flowers or is it actually based on which flowers it is? Aubrey gained one heart. Maybe Amori just gains the... Aubrey gained one heart. Maybe Amori just gains the hearts of the... The flowers relating to both Basil and... The other one. Well, I love how the... The cactus... Looks like... It's completely fine and untouchable. You know? Sometimes you just have to... Sit back. Amori gained one heart. Relax and smell the flowers. The roses. Whatever flower is available, just smell the flowers. Because who knows what's going to happen to those flowers. I can have a picnic here too! I wonder if this is because I've never had the picnic here or because... Do you think Basil is okay? I feel like maybe we should be more worried. Hmm... His disappearance is concerning, but it won't help to get everyone too worked up over it. Basil is really trusting. You believe any anything anyone says. What if someone tricked him into something? Or maybe he's fallen into a trap? Calm down, Aubrey. I'm sure we'll find him. I, kn I know. Why don't you all water his flowers while he's away? I'm sure he'll be super thankful once he's back. <laughs> Oh, Aubrey, come on. I don't like it when you cry. Cheer up. On the outside, Basil may seem really soft, but he's actually pretty strong on the inside. Basil can take care of himself. You should believe him in, in him a little more. Yeah. Well, when you put it like that... Okay, I'll try to believe in Basil. Thanks, Kel. Hehe. <laughs> ah, uh, don't smile at me. It's creepy. You're creepy. <laughs> oh dear god. I, I love the I love them. I wish I could have had a childhood like this. I really wish I could have had a childhood like this. This uh, this is Oh wow. Oh wow. This is bad. Look at all the poor flower, all the trees, everything's dying. Small plants, they look a little sad. Probably because their owner's missing. The floor is sinking. Well, this is all very bad looking. Right. There was a couple of things I had to do when we last left this place. And I think I remember what they were. One of which was, properly explore the cattail fields. Another thing was, go get my goddamn whatamacallit. You recycle that singular can. Because the fact I've... I was about to say, nothing seems to be here. Hello there. Hello fellow buddy hater! By looking in your eyes, I can see you've killed twenty. One bunnies. You still have to kill four more bunnies for your next prize. Go ahead and destroy the bunnies! 
Well, we can actually get into these areas now. You got a sparkler. Sounds dangerous. You got plum juice. Sounds nice. Train station Jash. Stop right there. You can't pass without a. Whoa! That's a train pass! You must be the last passengers. We've been waiting for you for a very long time. Well, that's an all clear from me. Welcome aboard, patrons. Huh. Then, no, you're not the... The way to get to... Where's Pluto's station? Wait, Pluto's thing's right here, isn't it? Yeah, here it is. The station for Pluto's space line. Do you want to wait? Is everyone... Everyone strapped in? Wait, hold on, I'm not ready yet! Bye, Cal! Right, let's go to other world, please. <laughs> I'm mostly interested if there's a new picnic. There is not a new picnic. Okay. Well, I still have that one singular can to recycle. Let's see if I get anything out of it. What do you give me? Five clams. That's it. I admit, I was kind of hoping for another trinket. A lowly crow picks up the dirt. It doesn't seem to notice you. What are these things? A UFO! Well, I mean, under the, the classification of a UFO, it is a UFO, so... As all UFO means is unidentified flying object. Hero feels sad. Wow, the UFO survived. Died to a hit from a hero? Man, that thing is worthless and useless. Hello there. Ah, a stranger. Thank you for having the time to talk to me. I apologize, but I'm afraid I must burden you with a task I cannot complete with my own capabilities. Quite recently and suddenly, a rogue planet burst across the sky at an alarmingly fast pace. My dearest three friends panicked and flew off in separate directions. My three friends are crows, you see, and are not the most friendly nor welcoming creatures. I'm a bit wary to ask such an immense favor from a complete stranger, but there aren't many who pass through these fields. If I may ask, would you be willing to help me find my dear friends? Sure. Oh, thank you, stranger. Words cannot express what this means to me. I shall now patiently await their return. For you see, without them, I am just i am just a stick in the mud. I mean, you don't have to get too literal about it. Isn't the sky beautiful? It's nice to know there are so many others out there who will share the same view. Cal, I swear to God, if you just took out all of them at once. Cal, you finally have earned some respect from me. That's all I'm gonna say. Either I missed a lot of chests last time, or I just simply couldn't get to them. Wow, miss, you sure are tall. Thank you, little one. It's more the hassle most of the time, but I do get a better view of the stars. What? Being tall isn't a hassle. Everything is better when you're tall. One day I'm going to be as tall as you. Yeah, sure, Kel. Keep dreaming. Can't go into the barn when it's like this. Interesting. What else might we find around here? Well, there's a crow. The crow doesn't want to talk to you. Perhaps if you were someone more charming? Be a little more subtle. Hey there, little guy. Your friend, Mr. Scarecrow, really misses you, you know. I can help you find him if you like. Ha! Ah, ha! Ah, please do if it's not too much of a bother. I miss him too. Can I go into the hole now? Oh yes, I can. This is where I saw a bunch of 
chests and whatnot when I first came up to this place, isn't it? Interesting. The Sprout Mower is small, is super glued to the wall. Okay, sure. You got dead batteries. Ooh, nice. Colony Mo. Many Sprout Moles used to inhabit this place, but a lot of them moved away to merge with a bigger colony somewhere in the big forest. It was a risky move, so some of us stayed behind. My brother left with the rest of the Sprout Moles. Do you think he still remembers me? I mean, if we haven't killed him, sure. I just realized how much rubbish we're getting. So we're going to have to spend a lot more time dancing at the machine, aren't we? You got cardboard. Greetings, traveler. Welcome to my home. It is humble and small, but it is mine. More cardboard. What else can we find? Computer part. Oh, hi, hero. I almost didn't recognize you. It's so dark in this game. I've always wanted to thank you for the time that you fulfilled my request of escorting me through the dangerous terrain. Here, take this. Batsy gave you a butt peach soda. Go forth, hero. Be the deliverer you are always meant to be. Is it just pure coincidence I was using hero then? Ooh, life jam. Ooh, fun. Most horse, first place. We sprout homos are highly intelligent creatures. Why do you have that? Compared to the centaur, which got second. I feel like guessing that the that the crows are somewhere around this place. You know? I mean, we already know where one of them is. Hello. Charming! Greetings, my feathered friend. Would you like me to return you to Mr. Scarecrow? He can't wait to be with you again. Car, car! Y ah, yes! That would be immensely desirable. Where might the last one be? Also, you are really working on the basis of numbers rather than anything, aren't you? Which doesn't really work when I've got Kel who can just do that. Sorry! How much XP is everyone off? Ooh, not actually that much. Where might the final crow be? Oh, there he is. Ah, convenient. One final rebound until we have to start fighting them, the fighting them legitimately, I suppose. Hi there, Mr. Crow. Hey, buddy. You want me to take you back to your friend, Mr. Scarecrow? Ha! Ah! Yes, yes, yes! Where is my friend? Take me to him! Well, we found all the crows. My friends, they have all returned. I cannot thank you enough for your help. It is now it is time for me to take my leave. Goodbye, kind stranger. I hope we will meet again one day. I mean, that's one way to transport yourself. You got a five leaf clover. That sounds absurd. What to do? Three leaf is plus five luck. Luck increases with more energy. What does that mean? Is it just five luck and it's being a little bit of a so-and-so and trying to explain what it does or what? Ooh, orange juice. Well, I suppose we are fighting oranges, so it makes sense to get some. You know what? I want to fight this thing. Just because I haven't fought one for a while and it did do a lot of annoying damage to me. Oh, I want a little bit of vengeance! Ha! You did nothing with that attack. You are weak! You are so very, very weak! You know what? I'm not a surprise. I'm not shocked that Imori's attack, uh, Aubrey's attack missed. It's about time she missed an attack, honestly. Given the fact she's not got a hundred percent hit rate anymore. But the shark also missed. With missed, so.
Did we level up? Nope. Can't be that far off. Nope, we are really not that far off leveling. I kind of want to finish the this this episode after leveling up. What other quests and whatnot might exist around here? We still need to figure out how to swim, honestly. So we can get whatever that chest is. Hero grew to level 12. Imori grew to level 12 and learned a lucky slice. Aubrey grew to level 12. Kel grew to level 12. Nice. I added Hero because Hero's first. Is the one I'm actually controlling at the moment. So what is Lucky Slice, Imori? Axe first. An attack that's stronger when Imori is happy. Aww. You can really work with the emotions and create a, a particular build, can't you? Well, if I'm not mistaken, I now have a bunch of recycling to shove in this machine before we end today. So let's go ahead and spend some time recycling and see what the hell we get. And no, despite everything, I'm not going to waste everyone's time this time with my incessant awful dancing to this little jazzy music. So there. I think I'm out? Yep. Recycling machine gave me crap all. Apart from, you know, like actual special things. So, the next thing I wanted to check was the horse. Did the horse have a quest for me? Considering. Nope, the horse does not have a quest for me, considering I saw the most horse person now. Well, everyone! I think this is a good place to leave today's episode then. Because you see, I'm all out of time for today. So, what can I say other than thank you all for joining me today? I have been your host, the Parafox Archangel, the English gentleman of the internet, and I hope to see you all again next time. But I'm afraid that until then, it is time for me to bid the all farewell, good day, and finally, good night.